Today is Friday, the 10th of February. The end of the work week for some, but not for all. I don't even worry about that stuff anymore. I don't even think about it, man. We got some burning going on here. Smells like burning pee. <laughs> Yeah. Good, they cleaned it. Uh, they got a lot more cleaning to go. Oh, whatever. Hey, I hope everybody had a good day. And they're having a restful evening. Did you have a good night's sleep? Yeah. yeah. Alright, it's good. We both didn't get up until what time? <laughs> 5 30? Something like that? For me, it's 5 30. Yeah. Yeah, we slept in. Oh <laughs> uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Eight hours. Yeah. The market's quiet. Believe me, you'll, some of you will say, "Well, it is six something in the morning." What time is it? Six forty-five in the morning. But you don't understand, man. These people are going at 5 30, 6 o'clock in the morning. It's a quiet Friday. So, what you got planned for today? Here do I. I have nothing. should be sharp when you first get them it's you as the user don't and then you got to get sharp to get it sharpened some people sharpen themselves oh yeah listening to music I got a uh, that video we uploaded yesterday evening yeah on the yes, barbecue barbecue pork shops they got demonetized because of the music in the background that's all right man yeah, yeah it's not a, it's not a uh it's not anything against me negative but they did ask me about it since i wasn't going to get paid for it I guess I'll get paid for the commercials, but I won't get paid for the video. I don't know, the ads, I don't know. But, uh, it's not a check against me. But they did ask if I wanted to take it down, I was like, nah. You know? You're not, I'm not gonna become a millionaire off of YouTube, I know that. <laughs> I know that for a fact, and that's not my goal, man. Some people, some people come here and they think it's going to be their income mm. and then they realize it's not and then they start e-bagging i just i just knew going into it man i ain't gonna become no millionaire doing this <laughs> and that's not my goal it's part of life man have what I think it's like ten ten dollars or something like that now that I earned on YouTube but I look at it this way I'm ten dollars richer today than I was a couple days ago so I just look you gotta look you gotta look at that day. the glass is half full look you know
and I got, you know, I just started this for my family, you know, back in the States. Now, do they watch my videos? Probably not. <laughs> See, I, I got, in the States, I, I have people that are, that are liberals, okay? <clears throat> and what you all know, I, I rarely talk about politics, okay? It's just, I, I ain't wasting my breath, but nothing will change, man. Nothing will change. I heard you. But I, I know the lines for the past when uh, DJT was in office for four years. Every day we heard them whining and crying and how evil he is and the world is collapsing and you know and it's doomsday and all this other stuff. But then all of a sudden, when Creepy Joe gets in the office. You know, oh, we're so tired of hearing about politics. We don't want to hear nothing at all about politics. Wait a minute, for four years you did nothing but bitch and complain, and now, you know, they're not dead, but now that Creepy Joe's in office, you don't want to hear nothing? Come on, man, you're a hypocrite. They, they still believe the fantasy that he's the greatest thing. The guy's an idiot, I don't care what anybody says. And actually, the uh, New York Times, whether you believe it or not, I don't read it, but the New York Times came out that uh, Oh Creepy Joe's approvals at four, like 43% or something like that. They say it's, that's the lowest of any president, at least six president has been in over 40 years. <laughs> I guess they have buyer's, buyer's remorse, I guess you could call it, where they regret something later on. <laughs> yeah. But they still don't want to hear it. You know? They were making up things when DJT was in office. But all of a sudden, you know, they don't want to hear anything about Creepy Joe. Oh no, you can't, he's our sitting president. Well, so so was DJT, you ran your mouth. <clears throat> it's, it's just funny, man. I just think it's hilarious. And everybody that tells me that thinks, you know, that, that's not it, to thinking the way they do, they say, talk. Even some people in my family say, talk about it every day. Who cares what they think? We listened to their garbage for the past four years. Now it's our turn. I'm feeling, I'm feeling kind of creaky today, man. You know? I'm feeling like an old man today. <laughs> uh, yeah. You have your good days, you have your bad days. Some days you can climb the mountains, the other days you have a hard time getting out of your chair. Uh, it sucks getting old. So have you decided what you want to do for your birthday or tomorrow? Mm -hmm. I told you we can go either Sunday, well, whatever day you want to go, we can go to the mall. And you can get yourself so I like I'm one of these people, I like to give people what they need, what they need or want. You ever get that them gifts, you're like, what the hell am I supposed to do with this? <laughs> you know? I'm not that way, man. I like to give people what they need or want. Tomorrow? tomorrow? All right, we'll go tomorrow. Well, tomorrow's your birthday. Okay. What, are you going to be 25? You're going to be 20, Miles going to be 25 years old, ain't you? <laughs> I think a lot of females do that. Once they get to a certain age, that, that they just stop counting. I'm 25 today. Well, you were 25 last year. That's right, I'm 25 today. <laughs> All right. 16. How old are you? 16? Yes. I can go to jail for that. <laughs> don't let that be, don't let anybody know that. 16. <laughs> That's creepy. <laughs> I 
All right, man. We might as well let you go. That comes your girlfriend. Nice. Yeah, she's she's a sweetheart. Right? She looks like she's in a bad mood. Yeah. Say other than, uh, how are you? Yeah, she's in a bad mood today. I say hello to that young lady at walk by, I say hello to her every day. She's like what, 13, 14 years old? She's not that old, man. And no, don't get creepy on me, man. She's in ninth grade. But I just, she, she has, uh, let me think, how could I say this? Be nice. she, she's got, not disability, but deformed, yeah. And she's kind of a loner, keeps to herself. And I'm pretty sure some people, kids tease the hell out of her. She has a cleft lip, that's what I'm trying to say. But uh, she's a really nice person, man. But like I said, I think she pretty much keeps to herself, which is a shame. All right, man, hey. Look at that, you can buy that, man. That's what you call a jeepney. Jeep. You can buy yourself one of them. <laughs> They're the ones, when, if you ever come to the Philippines and you see a big you cloud can, of smoke, that's the cause of, of it, huh? You can see a lot of that in Manila. Yeah. You <laughs> see a big cloud of smoke, that's the cause. Usually that's the cause of them, them jeepneys. All right, well, I'll say it again. I let you all go. You all be good to yourself, huh? You all be good to yourself, be good to each other. And talk to you later. Bye for now.